uh, hi everyone uh, welcome to my channel if this is your first time please kindly subscribe so that you don't miss out on the latest listings uh, in Uganda uh, I am Don Muyinza I'm a real estate agent in Uganda Kampala areas and uh, today I'm here in a place called Webaja uh, to show you some of the houses we have on sale uh, before I show you one of the houses here on sale, uh, I see you follow my those who follow my videos on property. Uh, some say the price is too high, uh, especially this goes to my friends in the diaspora. Uh, maybe those who have taken long without being back in the country. Uh, really uh the prices have really changed and property has gone high you know uganda is one of those countries which is highly populated so the demand has created uh some kind of uh, uh prices going high and also not forgetting the, the the free economy we are operating in whereby everyone determines their own price you know so uh normally prices we put here these are prices that have been uh put up by the owner you know so we don't it's not like we are overcharging no uh also the cost the labor you know when you put such things together you find that the price has to be slightly higher than expected also you have to consider the location. There are things that uh, make a property expensive or cheap. Uh, location. In real estate, location, the principle of location cuts across. When you ask what determines price, they will tell you location, location, location. Location is very, very key when determining the price. So uh, here is the shell house. I want to take you around briefly. It's a shell house. Uh, a shell house, I mean a house which is not yet complete. It has reached a certain level, they have done the plumbing. So, septic tank, it, uh, it is at this level now. Yeah, it's not yet finished. It is sitting on uh, 25 decimals. Or you can call it 100, and 100 by 100 feet. So, I want you to look at it. It is going for... The asking price is 250 million in negotiable. It's located in a very, very good environment. Very quiet place, especially for those who love quiet environments. So with, with its perimeter wall, I'm just going to take you roughly here and you see. Uh, it is an American design, uh, not the common bungalows which I viewed in Uganda. This, this one is uh, a unique house with a unique design. So it goes like this. So this is the behind part. So. so I've passed the behind part where you can be able to see the house. It's a four-bedroom house, uh, 250 million Uganda shillings. Those who are considering to buy a shell house and finish one, this is a multi-billion house. Once you finish it, it can be a very an amazing house for you. The plumbing is done, the wiring is done, you know. So, So I think this is something uh, you can finish it up. It's an outside toilet. But right now it's used as a, some sort of a store where you can renovate and it looks good. So I'm just moving around with the camera to show you how this house is. it is an American design American design the owner no longer 
have the money to finish this this beautiful house he she prefers uh to sell it off uh she's uh, old age so she she's she has no money now she <laughs> I show briefly. Keep some singing. an American design so this is the corridor that goes to the uh, this one bedroom there's a set of containing bedrooms then yeah from that bedroom you go to the next one there's another bedroom set of content then other bedrooms are this side but because there's a, a a uh, uh, caretaker who stays here. I didn't want to show his things here, but we can see. After all, it's just yeah. So there's a chamber boy staying around to keep the place. That's really good, right? Wow. Well, just give you uh, how the house is. So that side you see the road is just up there, it's not very far. So that side's Joma Supermarket. We have uh, Taiba International School. So let me open and show the outside part of it. That side there's the hotel garden. Yeah, going up to down with its waters. So on up that's Arkwright Estate. Yeah, so these other plots have been bought up. Yeah, owners haven't uh, yet taken decision to start constructing. Yeah, thank you for watching. Please kindly don't forget to subscribe, to like my videos, to share. Yeah, and those who want to talk to me directly on different properties to buy, on different properties to sell in Uganda, uh, please, uh, my WhatsApp number is plus two five six. Seven ninety four nine nine six one ninety four. Or you can write to me an email at an email uh, at uh, property go fast at gmail dot com. Property go fast at gmail dot com. Property go fast is a single word and fast is the F A S T. Property go fast is a single word at gmail dot com. You can also find me on Facebook, Doni Mojinza. Uh, be glad to see you. Get in touch uh, and we talk real estate. Thank you so much. Have a blessed day.